Hello. In this video I want to demonstrate to you why people who pluck, especially the ones who pluck daily or a couple of days or even a weekly pluckers, don't have the realistic idea about how much growth there is in an area. And we often get um, this type of client who comes in and says, oh I just have five hairs here, I just pluck them um, every week and that's all I have. And um, for them sometimes it can be a little bit difficult once they start seeing the full extent of um, the hair growth that they have in that area when they stop plucking. So for people who pluck, this video is for you. This will just show you how much hair growth you really have. Okay, we're going to have a look at this board and all the colours this time are forming just one hair cycle. But what happens? So our client who plucks today will pluck all the hairs that have come on the surface overnight, um, which for today are the green colour. Okay, so here we go, they're all plucked out. And again, overnight or over a couple of days, some more hairs have come through. Often uh, people will think it's the same ones because, especially on the face, uh, which is where people mostly pluck, their follicles are so close to one another. You have the highest number of follicles per square inch on the face, believe it or not. So the next plucking session be the day or two. Here we go. This little microcycle is created and that's been plucked out. Another couple of days, another little microcycle grows through and is being plucked out. So at any one time our plucker really thinks they have that amount of hair or something like this when they actually had all that we started with. Now what's going to happen when we start electrolysis, okay? So some of the hairs she will, she will mostly manage to wait for about a week, um, usually. So most of the hairs that are just about to grow will grow through in a week and the electrologist will take them out, okay? The client won't have any hair and they'll book for another week and by the next week all these hairs will have come through but often some of the hairs from another microcycle will have started growing as well and this time it will seem like there's more than the first time and now that is quite bothering for some people they're going to get all this removed okay clean slate and then give it another week and they'll have all of a sudden all this growth coming through okay I'm going to try and keep just two colours um, but generally trying to illustrate how So some of the microcycles where they've been plucked are coming through um, together with the one that, that's current and every week it seems like there's more and more in the area rather than less and less and this is a very, it's a difficult stage to grow through, to treat through but if you push through it for about three to four months after that it normally, the, the growth slows down because all of these hairs, they're not plucked and coming back, they're never coming back. So once you go, th go through all that aggressive stage in the beginning and treat all this hair, all of a sudden, by the next week, there isn't so much growth. And then uh, you space it out to two weeks, and in two weeks, there's a fair amount, but after another few treatments, you don't have so much hair, you either shorten the time, or you space it further with another week and so and so 
until between 12 months and 18 months there's hardly any hair grown and all you do is come in every few months to have the odd hair that's um, come to the area treated. Okay, I hope that this will help you to stay positive through your um, journey of electrolysis because I think electrolysis is a journey and um, good luck, all the best.